I was recently asked in a comment if a multi-pass instance could access the local network. And so the answer is yes. So here we are on the Windows machine. And all you need to do to have this able to access the local network is launch it with the bridged option. So you'd say multi-pass launch name test two double dash bridged and that should get our instance going here momentarily now my network segment is on 172.16.74.0 slash 24 and once this comes up you'll see that it can in fact access the local network Okay, launch test two. We come down here to the item in the taskbar, open shell, clear our screen, IP A. And you can see here we're on 172.16.74.198. So we come back to our Windows. Windows machine is on dot one twenty four. And so if we want to ping the multi-pass instance, you can see we're getting replies back. Now, one thing that I should mention, if this doesn't work for you, you may have to tell multi-pass to enable bridged networking. And this command is gonna look a little different on each platform. Since multi-pass is supported on Linux, Mac OS, and Windows, you have to enter the proper command for your OS. To find out what that network interface name is going to be, you would enter the multi-pass networks command. And as you can see, we've got Ethernet as the name for the built-in wired network controller. If you want it to be on the Wi-Fi network, you would say Wi-Fi and you would do that hyphenated as shown. And then you would enter another command, that command being multipass set local dot bridged dash network equals, in this case, it's going to be ethernet. If you're using a Mac, it might be something like EN0. If you're using Linux, it could be something different and that varies by Linux distribution. But this is the long answer to the question of whether you can get bridge networking to work from multipass. Now, in the 1.0 version, when I first started using multipass, this option was not available. It has since been added. And if you're using the current version, which at this time of recording is 1.12.2, you will have access to this command. All right, that will bring us to the end of this video. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Have a great day.